today i will like to discuss one of the famous interview question which i was facing when startup and product based company uh, so the the interviewer asked me like we need to print second highest descending order of their frequency the word he used second highest because descending order of their frequency so i will explain like what is the logic but uh, before that before that you need to watch my previous so what in first video what i have done in first video i am able to find the frequency of a string in second video what i have done like i am able to arrange the frequency based on the descending order and third video is this like we are only printing second highest descending frequency uh, second highest descending frequency so here the approach is like this is the input he has given if you see here he has given this input a b c is what he wants like uh, like we are able to find this frequency also we are able to find the uh frequency uh, based on uh set based on the descending order now he wants second highest descending frequency that is a is a4 this 4 has come second second highest frequency he doesn't want c5 b2 he just want this second highest frequency how we can achieve that but before that was that my two previous videos so here i'm explaining like logic is very simple what we will do here like here if you see yeah, you know like this process is like to find the frequency and uh, we can print the frequency by using this one and this logic is there to find the uh, uh to arrange the st uh, string based on the descending order of their frequency like i have done in previous video 5c is equal to 4a is equal to 4b is equal to 4 now the approach is very simple like what we will do here we will take one variable and count is equal to zero right so before this we will write one condition if if Font is equal to one, then only print this. Break. Just we are stopping. After we are printing, we are stopping. It is like same way, like uh, like when you go on board or something, you will see something, or you need to stop at that place, you will stop. You won't cross another road. Why? There's the reason is like we are using break. We are same way is there in programming also. Like we want to stop some uh, execution at some point of time, then will use this break now the thing is simple approach is there for this one font of cut plus plus here font plus plus so what it will do first for loop comes here it will check quantity is equal to one no condition fails then then it will go after if block and it will check count the count value is zero previously it is one now it, it has come now it will print second value so it will print this value yes i will show you here run a is equal to 4 it will print yes if you debug the code you will get to know here count is 0 no condition will come it is failed and we have what we have value we have we have uh, this value of c is equal to 5 so it is because this condition is failing now so it is it won't go that's all so brief before watching this story just watch my previous videos thanks